Okay, so I want to share a little bit about my Plexus business testimony today because it is one that is very interesting and long and I only have five minutes. So, um, <laughs> so I'm going to start off with my mother-in-law, Angie Ambrosetti. She started in 2015. She's now a diamond brand ambassador. Um, I didn't want to try the products until 2017 after having my first daughter. I was having some postpartum things and it was a total disaster, honestly. So out of pure desperation, I decided Plexus was worth a try. I started seeing results quickly and had other moms, or I started noticing that other young moms were struggling with the same exact issues I was and I wasn't alone. So that made it easy to start sharing. So about two years later, <laughs> I started sharing in 2019. Um, because Plexus had a free iPad incentive where if you added six, you got the iPad and we were broke and young and pregnant with number two and I was like, free iPad, I'll take it. <laughs> so I added my first six people, pretty much just family. Um, and I was one foot in, one foot out for a really long time. So by December 2020, I hit gold, but my builders quickly dropped off. They were not really in for the long haul and it was a lot of work in their minds and they just kind of dropped off and honestly i didn't know what i was doing either so i don't blame them <laughs> um, but i'm proud to report they're all back on my team working now <laughs> so i got stuck in the 70s for quite a while and plexus decided if you were an older gold you could hit if you hit gold again you could go to austin in october of 2023 so I worked as hard as I could. I still had no builders, but I knew I could get back to 100 points. So I earned the trip to Austin Gold School. My first, um, well, it was not my first Plexus event. I had been here before with my mother-in-law, <laughs> but it was my first Plexus event that I had earned myself. I left Austin feeling inspired, but also like it would still never work out for me. Like I just, was not good enough, people didn't like me enough, like I wasn't, it was not gonna happen because I had been here for quite a while. So November was a turning point because um, Plexus launched the free reset and I ended up adding 15 level ones and ended with a growth um, of over 120 points. And so, um, my husband convinced me to continue my personal development and see what happens because I felt really burnt out. I started working on um, personal development and working through my own childhood trauma that I had to overcome. With personal development work, everything started to improve in my life. My marriage, my children's lives, my business, everything started to change. Um, I started going to vendor events because I'm a homeschool mom. I don't have a large network. Um, my mother-in-law was a jewel and I just was like, I have to build my own. Um, so I started going to vendor events and that's when I signed up the 15 in November of 2023. I saw, um, massive growth, two new girls decided to work the business. And from there, I ended up earning leaders retreat in Punta Cana. And, um, and I hit senior gold as well in December. Then I ended January around 300 points. By the end of February, I had hit Ruby, actually February 28th. And for Angie and Megan Goff, that was just not enough. They decided I needed to go for senior Ruby because I had 24 hours left after all. <laughs> so the next day was leap year. And praise the Lord, because um, by February 29th at midnight, I had hit over 750 points. So my goal for March was to make it to the 1,000 point club, but in Angie and Megan fashion, that still wasn't what they foresaw in me. So they said, no, 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 you're going for Emerald this month. We're sorry to break it to you. So um, on Easter, I hit emeralds and um, it was quite the the evening because like right at midnight my points got stuck at $14.99 and it was like so traumatizing um, but anyways so I'm continuing to grow my team and a lot of the success has come through personal growth 
Um, I am not a natural go-getter like Angie. I really have to force myself to do anything uh, to grow or to self-motivate to get where I want to go. Personal growth has been a big game changer for me and has totally changed my business and my life. I had trauma from childhood that, I was, that was holding me back in a lot of ways. I had a hard time believing in myself um, that, I would, that I could achieve anything. Working and overcoming this has totally changed my life. I became a stronger version of myself and now encourage my team to do that as well. Personal growth looks different for everyone, whether it is a life coach or a book or a therapist or whatever, it looks different for everyone. But if you continue to do it, you will not be stuck anymore and you just have to break through your own junk and encourage your team to do the same. I have done that and we continue to see growth and breakthrough after breakthrough on my team. So, yeah, <laughs> thank you.